Whatever I do, there's passion in it. My motto is, what you could do today, you do it now so you could do something else tomorrow. Habang kaya ko pa at gusto pa ako na manunood, I'll continue till I kick the bucket. <laughs> Kahit effective na kontrabida, hindi siya magawang kainisan o kamuhian ng mga manunood. Masyado kitang inabi. <laughs> Oh yeah, well, I play uh, villain roles. Uh, when I'm hated, that means it was a good job. One time uh, during the Sampaguita days, I did a film with Gloria Romero. Uh, in, the, in the film, I raped her. I was the villain. In live theater, on the opening day, so I went there and when the lights uh, were on, there was an old woman behind with an umbrella and sucked me in the head. Bah! Then I look at her. Ito palang walang hiya. <laughs> isang karangalan para sa akin ng dalawin ako ng isang kababayan. Hindi kompleto minsan ng pelikula ni FPJ kung wala ang isang Eddie Garcia. Praise the Lord! Amen! Versatile, respetado. Dudukutin ko ang kanilang mga puso at buong buko ipapakain sa kanila. Hindi kumukupas kundi lalo pang humuhusay ang bawat pagganap sa paglipas ng panahon. Si Boss Mio po. Dali mo kumanta bata. Yan ay kamamatay mo. Parang ano siya, father figure ko. Pag nagsasalita siya, parang feeling ko laging minimentor niya ako kasi nakikinig talaga ako sa kanya. <laughs> Wala sa akin ang pagkamayor-mayor ninyo! Ang galing kasi hindi ito, Eddie. Pag umarte siya talagang dadala kayo. Ang galing na at this age, parang down to pa rin siya. Bakit nang ginagawa ito? Si Eddie Garcia, ang best actor ng gawad urian sa taong ito. Bakit nang ginagawa ito? Para sa kanyang pelikulang Dahil Martial Law. ML o Martial Law, pangatlong award na niya ito mula sa urian. Bagamat hindi na niya ito personal na natanggap sa entablado. Eh, very emotional kasi I ask for ano eh, yung message ng family. So gusto kong ibigay yung message nila at the same time. Nakakaba kasi baka hindi ko matapos yung message kasi naiiyak na nga ako eh. Karangalan ng pamilyang tanggapin ang inyong huling pagkilala kay Eddie. At itiyak namin ihingi ni Eddie ang inyong support ng panoorin ng mga hindi film. Namatay ako sa heart failure. Hindi ako nakapagpaalam na mamatay na ako. <laughs> Pinuri rin ang kanyang performance sa pelikulang Tampok Ngayon sa Netflix, Ang Hintaya ng Langit. Tungkol sa mga kaluluwang naghihintay sa purgatorio. Wala na po itigil sa akin para maghintay. Kaya hinintay kita. Sa edad na nubenta, tila wala siyang kapaguran. Saan ko na siyang na-interview para sa isa sa mga nakaraan niyang telenovela? Palagi ko dito sa kung mawawala kahit totoong toto ang mga pinuwag ng mga karakter. Dahil ang bawat isa rito may, may conflict, may uh, participation. Totoong totoo ko yung role na? Parang gano. <laughs> Bicolano si Manoy, Tubong Sorsogon. Sa set ng kanyang mga pelikula at TV shows, kilala siya ng kanyang mga kasamahan bilang laging on time. Well trained and ready to die. Well, in Sampaguita, if your call was 8 o'clock, you'd be there before or at 8 sharp. Because if you go 8, 10, you're fi fine. It's very important. Time, discipline. When you go to the set, you're prepared. The general will fulfill his promise that he shall return. I always wanted to be a soldier. Supposedly, I did not join the movies. Probably, I'll be dead. Six under frown in Korea. You can't win them all. If I survive that, I'll be a retired colonel. So that's destiny. Be sure to include this in your report. And I want it on my desk first thing in the morning. Pero ang nakatakda, nakatakda, walang kaduda-duda. Si Eddie Garcia ay para sa pelikula. Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! Hallelujah! See my phone? I don't like that phone. Noong 2018, na-interview siya ng Esquire magazine. Call time namin was 2 o'clock. 
He was there at 1 o'clock. Very, very professional. During the photo shoot, I asked him, can you cry for me in the camera? And then, like, instantly, he stared at me, and then he started crying. I felt the emotion, so behind the camera, I was also tearing up. I'm just so honored to the highest level to have been able to photograph him. It feels like I photographed a Philippine hero. Hello, sweetheart. Apat na raan lahat ang mga ginampanan niyang pelikula. Pero maging sa likod ng kamera, meron siyang mahalagang papel, ang pagiging direktor. Halos tatlumpong mga pelikula ang nagawa niya. Money earned but not spent is not your money. You make money, you just put it in the bank without touching it. What does it do to you? Nothing. The reason you earn, because you want to spend it. You cannot bring it to the grave. I'm a one-woman man. Well, yeah, because like having so many love affairs at the same time, it's a headache. You, you waste your time lying and cheating. <laughs> Mahal ko siya, tulad ng pagmamahal ko sa iyo, Ina. Napakialam ko anong sabihin nila. Ano, nabakla ako? Ang pagmamahal niya sa kanyang trabaho hanggang sa kaduluduluhan ng kanyang buhay. Mayroon pang isang hindi ko nagaganap pa nang pangarap kong paggampanan, leading lady. <laughs> Pumanaw si Eddie Garcia noong Webes, June 20. He's a living legend, always passed on, but he will live on as a legend. Hindi ko makakalimutan kay Eddie Garcia itong huli naming pinagsamahan. Eh, meron pa kaming kissing scene. Being the Eddie Garcia of the industry, yun yung nawala sa atin, uh, a person to look up to. I guess that's what we will miss. Oh, my dad is a very loving and caring person, and he's a very private person. Well, maraming salamat sa pagmamahal niya sa akin. Lagi kong dasal sa may kapal ang lumigaya ka. Hindi kaya panahon na upang ikaw ay mamahinga. My belief is, when you're dead, you're dead. <laughs> If your time is up, that's it. When your time is up, you're dead and people forget about you. Yeah. How would you want to be remembered? Frankly, I don't give a damn. <laughs> Malaya na ang pakiramdam ko dito. Mabigat naman dahil hindi ako nakapagpaalam na mamatay na ako. 